Hi class, welcome to our video classroom. Who likes eggs? Well, I'm sure if you like eggs, you like this texture technique using their shells. Eggs have been used for centuries in many cultures and can be used all over the world. Here's a quick look at some basic information on all, on all the materials we're using today. Paint brushes, mixing trays, water containers, glue, eggshells, boxes or cardstock, liquid water colors, and pouring medium. First you're going to make sure that you have all your material laid out in front of you. After you're all set up, start painting glue on the working surface. Students will be making their art on paper mache boxes today, but you can use a variety of surfaces from cardstock to canvas to boxes. Once the glue is painted on, crush and apply eggshells by gently but firmly pressing onto the board. It takes about 10 minutes for the glue to dry. Be watchful of shells pulling away from the board and lightly press back down on them. Pro hint. Using a hair dryer speeds up the drying process after the eggshells are applied. The next step in your project is to apply watercolor to your piece. Watercolors come in a variety of shades, but today we have blue-green, coral, brown, and blue-violet. Keep in mind the art elements and principles you have already learned when making your art piece. Try to use at least two different colors in the piece. Use more if you want. Pro hint, using the inside of the eggshells facing out versus the outside will create a different look. The inside of the eggshell being more bright and the outside being more pastel and dull. Overlapping and layering the eggshells creates more texture and dimension. Paint the pouring medium over the project after you, have complete, you are completely done with a watercolor step. Waiting for watercolor to dry is not necessary. The pouring medium looks milky at first, but will dry clear. Once all our projects are done and dry, this usually takes about 10 minutes. Share your project with your classmates and talk about at least two elements or principles you used when creating your project.